So anyways, I met Dr. Seacrest about a year ago. A guy was telling me that, uh, I saw a guy at church, and he was telling me that uh, he felt like really good. And I said, what's going on? What did you do? And he was like, oh, I got these pellets. And I, I had no idea what pellets were. Now, being on the radio, I hear commercials about people talking about... Um, uh, you hear stuff about testosterone and guys and their testosterone, losing your testosterone and you want to lose some body fat and all this stuff. So in the back of my mind, before I even talked to him, I thought, what am I going to do? I want to try maybe take these shots or do something. So then when I talked to him, he was like, you got to try these pellets. And he kept on telling me about how great he felt and, and how strong he's got and all this stuff. And usually when people tell me something that um, it sounds too good to be true, what is it? It's too good to be true. And so I took that with a grain of salt, and I was like, I want to prove this guy wrong. There's no way that this could do what he's telling me it did. So I came in, I got my blood tested. I think my testosterone was in the 500s. It's probably, it's not that bad for a guy my age. And so, but ult, what's the ultimate, like between nine and, yeah, maybe a thousand. yeah, something like that. So I thought, well, I want to get it up there and see, see what happens. So, uh <laughs> So I have my brother, I, actually my brother drives a truck and he never works out. Like I work out five days a week, I play basketball and all this stuff. So he got his testosterone drone and it was 75. And the doctor told him, women have more testosterone than you do. And so he's only a year older than I am. So everybody is against their testosterone level and I'm real competitive and stuff. So I wanted to rub it in his face if I could get my testosterone up to be a thousand. But uh, so I went and... Uh, uh, so I, I said, uh, so I tried the pellets and I said, well, let me just try it one time to see if it works. Cause I wanted to tell him, you know, it's, it, it's like Jack selling the beanstalks. It sounded too good to be true. So I tried it the first week. I didn't really feel a lot of difference. Second week I thought, well, I mean, I want to feel different, but I didn't. The third week I felt a little bit different. I was like, if this is all it is, then uh, I don't know, because I'm going to the gym, I'm doing the same workout and stuff. But when the fourth week hit, there was something that went off inside my body because I had more energy than I've ever had. And it wasn't like the weird energy, like when you drink energy drinks and you feel jittery or anything. It was like, literally, I felt like I could do anything. So with my sets, like I do three sets of 10, I could then do three sets of 20. I mean, literally could go 10 more in each one. I was like, what's happening to me? Like, literally, I felt like I had a superpower or something. So I said... <laughs> And then I started sleeping more. And so I take a nap in the afternoon because I get up early in the morning. So my naps were usually two to three hours. Uh, but then my nap was like 45 minutes that next day. I felt, and I was like, oh my gosh. And I woke up and I said, I felt like I slept for eight hours. Next thing I know, I remembered like three dreams that I had. And like everything that Dr. Seacrest had said in this meeting, I was like, dang it, it's coming true. Everything he said is exactly right. Usually that never happens. Like anywhere in life, you go somewhere, it seems too good to be true. But that's actually what happens. So. Uh, so I, after that, a week, uh, after that, that first week, I used to go to the gym. And so for me, it was more about recovery time because when I play basketball, I play with a bunch of 20 year olds and I'm going to be 50 next year. So I, uh, I get home and like, after I'm done playing basketball, I have to crawl to the bed sometimes because my legs and everything hurt. But the recovery time was the next day I woke up, I felt exactly the same I did the day before. Perfect. And I was like, I can't believe the recovery time that I don't know. I don't know the science behind pellets or anything like that. I think this guy's a genius. So I, I do the things that he says because my body has felt like great. And I think I've lost a good, good amount of pounds. But the thing about not losing weight, I, my body just shaped differently. Like I've done the same workouts and stuff, but with the pellets, my body completely changed its shape and stuff. Things that I wanted to, to look like when I was in my twenties and stuff. So I don't know how it works, but it works. And so um, and then my wife went to get them done too, and she's loving that. She's lost weight. She has a hard time sleeping at night, but with the pellet, she sleeps a lot better. So I don't know what the science is behind it, but I love that it builds your bones and that you know protects you from prostate cancer, those kinds of things. And so the, that's just like icing on the cake for me.